Hi everyone and thanks once again for tuning in to Smash Factor TV. My name's Natalie Adams. Today we're going to have a look at the role of your right arm in the golf swing. If you're a right-handed player, your trail arm. Okay, so when we go from setup position, the right arm really wants to remain quite passive during the backswing, but the main thing that uh, we'd be looking for you to achieve with your right elbow is that we get the, the correct rotation into your right arm and that we see the elbow is underneath your hands. So this is the correct kind of position that we want to see for your right elbow and your trail arm. It's really important you've got that rotation into the, uh, into the trail arm so it stops you coming over the top it'll get you to hit much more from the inside it'll also keep your arms and your body more synchronized together so that you can rotate your body much better through impact see far too many uh, players who i start to work with will uh, swing the club back and the right elbow will have pulled out and there's not the correct kind of rotation in the right arm there that elbow needs to be rotated from the shoulder so it's the the upper arm we're getting the rotation into that elbow looks a lot more underneath the hands than out in this position here because it's going to give you a big issue on your downswing that you're going to tend to make this over the top movement uh, and you'll find it very difficult to hit from the inside with maximum power and again looking from head on i think it would look it would be a lot better to see right elbow in this type of position here so making a right angle if you like looking from this way on rather than it's pulled back and in this kind of position here where it's disappeared behind the shoulders okay so a great drill to work on to help you learn how this right shoulder should rotate and the position that that right elbow and the right hand should get into if you just hold one of your irons in your right hand with the shaft pointing down to where towards where the ball would be if you make your back swing okay so you're turning your upper body and then once you've got to about two-thirds of the way back let this club just rotate over in your hand so that the club shaft drops down behind your bicep so you should be able to hold that uh, club shaft in position there and that'll help you get the arm into the correct position if I just show you from this way on so you'd hold your club head here we're going to swing that club back to about two-thirds of the way back instead of the elbow pulling out like this which would make it really difficult for you to to get into position there we need to from here we need to let that club rotate over so it hits the back of the bicep it's pointing straight down so we've got a vertical shaft position so that you can hold uh, the club with your left hand there and you've learned how to turn your shoulders into that position so that's what we want that gets the right hand in, in an ideal position for the top of the backswing and then you can work on making your downswing from there by that right elbow moving in towards your ribs rather than if you're coming in from this position it's very difficult to get the correct movement in that uh, downswing into your trail arm have a go at that on the range really important to do that exercise a lot to learn that feeling of the rotation that you need in that right arm the hand position the elbow position but once you've got used to it you'll certainly hit uh, a lot better golf shot it's a game-changing golf tip <laughs> 